Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So I'm about to take up my latest champion to rank four. Uh, I have a rank up gem, Science, and just show you guys what I'm working with here. So I actually have two. I have a two to three and a three to four. So what you're seeing here at the bottom row from Spider-Man, Yellow Jacket, Sentry, uh, Spider-Man, Miles Morales, and Rhino, those are my only rank two champions. So for the two to three, that's my selection. I'll worry about that later. But the three to four, I've got Captain America, Ant-Man, MODOK, Invisible Woman, Luke Cage. Uh, everyone else is already rank four. So honestly, it would be between Luke Cage, Invisible Woman, as far as usefulness goes. And since I tend to use Invisible Woman in uh, some synergy teams, as well as a possibility of using her in Alliance War Defense, that's who we're gonna do today. All right, and we'll take a look at her and we'll uh, show you some gameplay as well. All right, so let's go ahead and use up this gem. And boom, she is my latest rank four champion. Now, another thing, a uh, reason that I was thinking of ranking her up is because of the Fantastic Four uh, synergies. They have great synergies. Reed Richards is not in the game just yet. So I'm not sure what that's going to look like. Uh, she may end up with some really crazy synergies. So I want her up there. Uh, now, Thing is already... Let me just use some of these guys just to speed it up. Don't do what I do. Don't do it. I know it hurts, but just trying to speed things up. But Thing is already rank five. So I want her to be at least rank four. And Reed Richards, when he comes in, if I get him, I would want to take him up as well. I don't have Human Torch. So if I ever get Human Torch, I'll probably take him at least to rank three all right so that is it she is now rank four let's take a look at her look her little sexy self let's take a look at her attributes that's not a double entendre here we go you see her attack you see her champion tags here scroll down and uh switch over to percentages okay her block proficiency is actually pretty good uh, that's a really good block proficiency, all right? And let's take a look at her synergies. Okay, of course, she has the synergies with the other Fantastic Four members. We don't know what those are. Uh, there we go with those. We're not going in-depth here, just showing it to you. Uh, Namor, great. Let's uh, take a look here. She's not awakened. Uh, hopefully, I'll awaken her naturally at some point in time. But take a look at her abilities here. Uh, again, we're not going into it uh, in this video, but I will create um, a video, a closer look video on her where we go in depth on her abilities. And uh, I do more than just show you guys gameplay. But with that said, on to the gameplay. All right, so we're going into Realm of Legends, of course. You can see the team that I chose to go in here with. I activated some of her synergies, but honestly, I'm not sure yet how to play her uh, to her fullest. I don't know how to get the most damage out of her, uh, but we're gonna showcase a little of her block proficiency. I want you guys to see that. Uh, this is not a uh, complete fight. I do end the fight early at around 100. I think it was 105 hits but first I'm gonna build up to the special one so you guys can see her special one all right and uh, once you get to see that I'll build up to the special two and then the special three then I'll play for a little bit I will fire off uh, a heavy 
attack so you can see her heavy animation as well all right so i like her animations a lot and whoever did the graphics for her uh the artwork the animation excellent job a plus all right so you saw there a little bit now i am running suicide but i want you to see how much damage she took from his special look at her health okay she did not take a lot of damage at all and i need to learn how to play her a little bit better i could have stopped blocking and uh taken no damage i believe uh, but in the closer look video that I will come out with a little bit later, I'll do more research into her, find out, you know, what she can do, how I need to play her, uh, whether her awakened ability makes that much of a difference for her, you know, so we'll see. All right, so there you go. That is her special three. She just looks so good. I got to admit, whoever did that probably has too much time on their hands. I want to see whoever modeled for this. Uh, I don't know if you guys are aware, but uh, many game companies, when they create their champions or characters like that, they often use real life models. Uh, so I would love to see who the real life model is for this if uh, they used a real life model. But anyway, notice after taking specials, uh, recoil damage and all of that, look at her health. This is pretty impressive. Okay, she's not the greatest damage dealer or anything like that, but look at the damage that she was able to take. So I'm liking this. I'm liking her a lot. Um, but would I use her? I don't know yet. I don't know where I would use her, but she is pretty tanky. Okay, so here you see I'm just ending uh, the fight here at 105, and then I'll show you guys, you know, what the damage uh, is that she did so that's gonna do it guys hopefully you enjoyed the video click like subscribe leave a comment let me know what you thought about this video and remember i will be doing a closer look video later on and you all have a blessed day